one I'm about to show you, I was doing another repair. This is one of the uh, older carrier package units. I was doing another repair. I was just wanting to hook up my gauges and check pressures before I leave. And the Schrader port literally fell off. Lost all the Freon. Now, if you've been doing this as long as I have, you've seen this too. But this is a video of how I like to deal with that particular problem. Well, as I was trying to screw on my gauges, you see what happened. It was hooked up right here. I'm going to cut that like I have. I'm going to put some 7 8 over the top of it. Um, and put this in. Tell you what, this job was easy when it turned it into something hard. Alright. So that's what I'm starting with. 7 8 over the top of it. I got a, a hole for my trader here. I'm going to leave the hole open and leave the Schrader out when I start to weld because there's Freon in that accumulator. So I need to weld it up and make sure it has a way to escape before I put the Schrader in. And now that I'm welded up, you see all the, <clears throat> what's probably phosgene coming out that core. We're fixing to pressure test it and see if I got any bubbles on this. And then we're going to finally get out of here. No bubbles, no hissing, not but about 46 PSI, but I'm fixing to put the Schrader in and try to 